in this video i am going to explain about the connection pooling we are going to do now is a go add and modify our database connection object by uh, configuring uh, that max open connections max idle connection and max connection uh, and the max uh, connection maximum lifetime properties and uh, here we are set for the first we set for the um, max open connection then uh, we here we are the uh, db current object for uh, initializing the uh, db connection and db current object dot uh, set max open connection uh, here i set for 4 and next one is the uh, max um, idle connection Here, here also set for next one is the max lifetime connection dp con dot set max lifetime and here we are set the 30 second as the uh, uh, maximum lifetime uh, for for one query and uh, 16 to time dot seconds and this is the uh, property uh, mm, database connection properties first one is a set to max opens and set to, next one is a set to max uh, idle connection and uh, next one is the uh, set to max lifetime uh, lifetime uh, connections also Uh, now, now because of, uh, we are limiting the uh, uh, number of connections uh, we need to uh, make sure that uh, we are handling uh, the cases uh, uh, cases where a uh, bunch of clients uh, clients uh, could have long uh, running queries and our connections uh, pool uh, and our connection pool has no more uh, available connections uh, changing uh, our, uh, our our connections uh, we are uh, we are uh, uh, we are working with a uh, database first uh, we, we need to create the uh, context and uh, here the uh, get uh, get all products is the first uh, uh, first uh, function uh, for fetching the all the products uh, here we, we, we need to cre uh, create the context uh, context uh, for running the query so we are going to uh, use the context dot without time uh, with, uh, without ti uh, timeout function to create the uh, create a new co context First one is the con context comma cancel uh, in a cancel then I'll create the context dot context dot with the timeout of uh, context dot background uh, comma here I add the 15 seconds and uh, I defer the uh, sorry defer the cancel and uh, we need to uh, change the uh, uh, normal query functions the uh, query context functions and here I add the context and I, I here I add the uh, context this way we need, need we need to change the uh, all the uh, our query function with the context uh, so, so i copied that context uh, next one in main function we have the get all product and next one is get product with id and here also, also i add the context and change change the query row to the query row context next function is uh, add product method here execute context and add the context uh, object next one is the update product data Change the function context to con execute context. CMTX. Next one 
next one delete product then we um, uh, will go to run the program go run, go run main dot go okay i didn't start my uh, uh, my van Into data, please. What happened? Remove it. Route is change anything here i forgot to add the uh, at, uh, seconds so stay come under the data Then I change this Can I run the board? Yes, here it is. I forgot to add the time dot sec uh, second time in, in context uh, creations. Uh, this is all about how we collect uh, a data, uh, connecting the uh, poll and how we handle the maximum connections uh, in our uh, database driver. Database driver. Uh, this is all about connect connecting poll.